What's up? I'm JC and I am a rising junior at the University of Michigan on the gymnastics team. I am a co-host for Beam Queen Bootcamp this year. Hi, I'm Natalie. I was a gymnast at the University of Michigan for five years. I'm a national champion on the balance beam and I have two perfect tens on beam and I'm a co-host at Dyer, Indiana. So last year during Beam Queen I was an intern so I basically learned everything that Sam does during the camps. I learned how to do some of the merch tables, some of the organization side of things. I learned how to run each rotation. And this year I am a co-host, so Nat and I are co-hosts together. In previous years, I was a coach at Beam Queen. I've done it for, I think, the past three summers. And this year, as a co-host, I get to have a little bit more experience working behind the scenes. So I got to help out with the preparation before we got here and then we set everything up last night and so I got to have a little bit more experience in really bringing the camp to life before it even starts and I'm really excited to see all of the amazing things that happen here this weekend. We will basically teach our staff how to do each rotation, we will do registration, we will do the intros and the closing and lead the warm-ups. So Basically, we're taking everybody, including the staff and the campers, through the camp, and it should be a really good experience. So I'm taking on more of an organizational role, whereas JC is the MC. So I'm taking care of behind the scenes stuff, helping out with parent questions, registration, um, organizing the groups, and JC is the voice that you hear on the mic. She's leading the warm-up while I'm kind of demonstrating the warm-ups. I will be on the mic while we are doing beam stories and doing the three rolls of beam, all of that kind of stuff that involves a lot of the talking in front of the kids. And then Nat is doing more of the organization role where she is taking care of all the behind the scenes logistics of everything, making sure that everything's in order and in line so that whenever people come walking through the door, we're ready to go. I think that our strengths complement each other, but also our weaker spots are kind of complemented by the other person and so between the two of us I think that we're a really good pair. We bring a really creative approach to problem solving and also just preparing for an event like Beam Queen Boot Camp. I think we'll work really well together as a team. Um, I mean gosh we're best friends and we're laughing all the time together but we can also get, also get stuff done. I feel like we formed a relationship almost instantly even though we're like three years apart in age, we're just the bestest of friends. We love all the same things, coffee and ice cream. She basically brought me under her wing at Michigan as a freshman and taught me all the ropes of campus and just brought me into her life as somebody that was just such an inspiration to me, but also became one of my best friends. And I'm so thankful for our friendship. We hang out all the time outside of gymnastics. Whether it's in the gym or outside of the gym, and we're just the bestest of friends. <laughs> Luckily, I still have her in Michigan for another semester, so I'm sure lots more coffee dates will be coming soon, and I'm just really excited that I get to do this with her. At the retreat, we talked a lot about just instilling confidence in others and showing up as your best self so that you can pour into others, and so I'm really excited to have that kind of influence on these kids here. We get to teach these little kids how to be their most confident selves and still have fun doing the sport that we all love and share together. And I think it's just a really cool opportunity because not only is it a gymnastics camp, which we all love the sport, but we also get to teach these kids how to be confident, how to be brave and courageous. And I think there's just so many lessons that we get to instill in them. And I think it's a really, really cool opportunity. I'm going to be running the confidence rotation today. And so um, that's something that was really special to me as an athlete is your mindset and your approach to beam and how you can develop so many other applicable life skills and just things that bring you joy and confidence and so um, I think we really touched on that a lot at the retreat and it's something that I'm excited to put into practice here. We're here with an incredible staff in Dyer and I think it's just such a special camp because there's not really anything out there like it and I think Sam has done an incredible job leading the way for something unique like this and I'm just really grateful to be a part of it. Watch the wires. You guys didn't know you were getting a workout in today. <laughs> <laughs> the caboose. Caboose. <laughs> oh. <laughs> 
Okay, so the choreography plan or what I'm planning to do this summer, I'm doing, I'm doing four, but for this one, I'm gonna have I'm gonna have just one song, and each group is gonna have a different part of the song, so it's gonna be like a whole production type of thing. There's going to be blocking, there's gonna be transitions. So usually each group I do has a different song, but it's gonna be the same song, and it's gonna be like a transitional piece. So I'm very excited. Ooh. Stay tuned. <laughs> Both are the best. I can't yes. both they're, they're so crunchy. They're so crunchy. They're fresh. You guys look how dedicated she is. Just bring it on in. Like literally. Like, literally. Like, huh? All of the things. The dedication. This is the the organization. Yeah. Finishing pose. <laughs> When the first rotation starts, you'll want to just run through your list and make sure that all the kids are there. So yeah, that's all for now. Ava is switching from group one to group two. It's go time. There you go. They're ready. They are ready. So ready. I said like a super quick staff meeting because I wasn't sure if we'd have time, yeah. but luckily yeah. everyone except for high school has done this before. Yeah, I was so. gonna say like out of, out of all the staff, they all figure it out. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, get on in there. Take a breath. Yeah. Let me know if you need anything. I'll take care of the rest of this. Oh, here we go. I'm kind of nervous. No, we got it though. I'm like I'm like confident, you know, but I've just have never led the whole thing before. But there's a first time for everything. You're gonna crush it. It's gonna be great. Welcome in. So welcome to MTV Cribs. I think high school's the most nervous. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a brand new, never before seen warm up. <laughs> okay, the first announcement needs to be to not get too close to the edge of the floor. I'm like shaking. I know, it's like excitement though. Testing, one on All right, my team queens, if you wanna make your way over to this blue floor and we can get started. Yay! We're going to start out with a little bit of a dance. We're gonna get our hips moving. It's gonna be fun. Get loose. I'm not the best dancer myself anyways, so no one's embarrassed around here. Let's get started. And if you, if you get lost, just follow them, follow me. So if you have been to Be With Me before, you know that we expect you guys to introduce yourselves to everyone in the group and to be really warm and friendly, especially to those gymnasts that have come by themselves. Don't worry, it's a very warm and friendly environment. You're gonna have a lot more fun than I think you might think you will have the eight hours of beam. Just embrace it, listen to your coaches, and just have some fun, yeah? And walk, yes, work. I want you to think about a goal that you have before we come to Beam Skills tomorrow, and then we're going to share it, and we can keep each other accountable. Sound good? Everyone goes through that, even the best beam workers. And you can practice navigating that routine in your head while you feel those kind of nervous jitters that you can get. One thing that I have to say, which would be good advice, is to always speak positive things into yourself. Good morning, Beth. I'm here. How am I doing? Thank you. I'm well, pumped for day two. This is our long day because we have day two of session one and day one of session two. 
but it's always so fun because you get to work with so many kids and I think it's gonna be a great day. I got to talk to the girls last night at dinner and it sounded like a lot of really great things happened and it seems like the kiddos are making progress and having fun and that's really all we can ask for. Good morning. Are you ready for day two? I am, it should be a good day. Everyone's still at the merch table, they want somebody clothes. I'm like, come on up. Welcome to day two guys, are we excited? Yeah. I know it's early but we're gonna bring the energy, we're gonna have some fun. those people that are sitting way up top, right? They have to be able to see what you're doing, yeah? I want you guys to dance super big and be really bold in your movements, yes? So the bigger you do your movements, the better it looks. Walk around. Oh. Nice. And go. You just scared me. <laughs> and you would not want to go for your back handspring. The judge always starts counting. and each group comes on one after the other. It's really, really cool. Thanks to our incredible choreographer, Janae. Let's give it up for Janae. Team Queen Super? So we are starting to do registration for session two now, and I am just putting some final touches on. I'm putting the tattoos and the stickers in the bags, and then we'll be ready to get started for session two. Welcome to Beam Queen Boot Camp registration process. We have the merch table oh, over here, <laughs> balloons, photo op with the photographer, and check-in with their spot bags. You'll just want to put your name and your group number on the table on the side with the pen. Okay. Um, Welcome to Beam Queen. <laughs> Why is he laying? Like, he talked to all, like he was watching TV. <laughs> Who's ready for day one of Beam Queen Boot Camp? That sounded a little bit sad if I'm being honest. Who's excited for day one of Beam Queen Boot Camp? The entire point of Beam Queen is to get outside of your comfort zone and find ways to grow and to get better. JC doesn't always love dancing, but she gives it her best shot. You don't have to be the best at it to have fun and to be good. I want all of you to join me in giving this warm up our best effort and we're gonna have a whole lot of fun together. And put your crown on your head. How do I squeeze to make my body straight? Yes. We should always be like this. So it's a half, but you split over the beam. Sassy, sassy, slaying. That's another good word. <laughs> you're on that side, which means you overcorrected. So you're doing it right. Yes. So now you just gotta meet in the middle. But it's how you approach those emotions and those things that you're telling yourself that separates a great beam worker from a good beam worker. You gotta show the camera your makeup. Ooh, and the nails? She ready. <laughs> Use your butt when you step in. Arms. There you go. Good job. Good. The thing that I really learned is 
It's so much easier if you can have fun on the beach. No need to get here super early tomorrow. And scene. <laughs> I don't want to drink the wraps. Mm -hmm. It's just like it's getting the job done. It just stays in between. Dirty. Calm before the chaos. Do you want to start with the stand up? Yeah. Are you ready to get started? <laughs> First group, go! <laughs> that was good, that was good! You need a confident body and a confident mind. So for me, it looks like this. Arms, eyes, home base. Listen to the words, listen to the lyrics, and have fun with it. And I want to see you guys smile, especially on this part. Loved it and we all had so much fun. I feel relieved. Um, I'm glad everybody had fun. Not too many hiccups. Everything was smooth and I saw a lot of joy in the kids' faces and our staff did great too. So I feel really proud and happy and I can't wait for another one. Thank you to Midwest for being an incredible facility, hosting us this weekend and providing this amazing opportunity for us. Being Queen Super. <laughs> <laughs> you are the Queen Queen Supreme! <laughs>